hello everyone welcome to 10 in 18 you know series life career and business optimization lesson length and still learning in 18 years i'm going to build the lessons i'll be sharing about my around my favorite letter you know which is the letter p you know i'm going to build the 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 the, the lessons i'll be sharing ar around that so i've selected 10 p's you know that i believe that you know uh, you know encapsulate the lessons i've learned and some of the things i would like to share you know with our community and my colleagues you know our clients uh, you know basically what what about what i've learned in the last and i'm still learning over the last 18 years so these are the p's the first p is psychology you know i'll go into different explanation of each of the p's the second p is philosophy you know the third p is pursuit fourth is productivity the fifth one is practice sixth is preparation you know i have a deep deep connection with preparation seven is performance you know i'm very very performance oriented you know yeah i am a bit you know to the extreme on performance people you know very very crucial places you know and what i like to term progress okay so the 10 p's you know these 10 p's are you know i've just used them as a framework you know to really really share deeply some of the biggest biggest most powerful lessons like i said inside bending perception expanding life changing lessons i've learned in the last 18 years so let's dive in the second lesson you know, out of the 10 P's, you know, the 10 P's I've learned in 18 years is philosophy. You know, that's the second person, that's the second lesson, okay? Philosophy. Who is a philosopher? You know, if, I, if somebody asks you that question, okay? A philosopher is simply a lover of wisdom, okay? It's simply a lover of wisdom. And wisdom is critical if you're going to think right okay wisdom is critical if you're going to think right you cannot change the way you think without loads and loads of wisdom in fact you can only transform through the renewal of your mind and to renew your mind you need wisdom and you need to adopt this mindset this thinking that every day must be a school day if you want to go far every day must be a school day okay you have to find a way to learn from other people you have to find a way to study to read whatever works for you every day must be a school day one of the things that i learned very very early is that look one constant thing in lagos is traffic you know so the best thing i learned this from a mentor is to enroll in what they call traffic university turn that traffic into an opportunity where you're learning invest in audio learning you know whatever it's important you know because that's in return help to renew your mind and when you think right you know you succeed you get to the top of your career and one of the very very important thing about philosophy is you sharpen your philosophy you know when you start asking the right question and questioning is important is the most fundamental skills because you can't learn anything without asking the right question you have to learn to ask questions questions like what don't i see okay where is my industry growing and what is the implication of my career okay why am i do not doing well what can i do better who should i be serving and how well should i be serving them you know you have to continue whatever because that affects that bring forces you to look for answers which gives you wisdom you know and then you start to renew your mind and then you get it right okay and one of the best philosophy i came across is this philosophy of you know winning forever okay there's a philosophy called win forever philosophy which says that you should make your proud best your new baseline on a daily basis okay this is how to grow make your every day i ask myself how can i get better today what can i do better what can i improve on what can i learn today every day okay every day and this really helps my mindset i'm a learner committed i love learning i'm Learning is an obsession for me, you know, because it helps me to think right and do the right thing and help me grow my business, which I happen to love a lot. Okay. So adopt a win forever philosophy. 
make your power best your new baseline on a day-to-day -day basis some people their power best <coughs> is even lower than their new baseline and then they wonder why they struggle some people their power best they 10 years ago they've not improved they just whatever okay claim that they have 10 years 10 years experience no it's one year experience repeated 10 times okay you need to refine your philosophy you need to invest in consistent continuous never ending improvement okay because that impacts on your mind and then that helps you create success so the second lesson is your philosophy you need to have a refined philosophy you need to be a lover of wisdom and you need to adopt the mindset that every day is a school day okay that's a major lesson game changing lesson for me okay the next lesson you know which is also very powerful 